coming to you. It is December the 14th, and we are glad to be here again with you reading the verse from our daily Advent reading for the month of uh, December. Looking forward to, believe it or not, uh, what are we, about 10 days from Christmas Eve, and so uh, it is coming, ready or not, and uh, hopefully you're going to be ready for uh, Christmas and time with family, friends, whatever your uh, Christmas season brings for you. Uh, today, an interesting verse that I want to share with you about uh, the Christmas Advent. And again, uh, December the 14th, and we encourage you to read uh, the passage uh, that is in there. But uh, the verse itself is from Jeremiah chapter 15 and verse 16. And part of the Advent reading today is talking about Christmas uh, goodies. Uh, I don't know about you, but uh, I think with age, I become less focused on gifts and become more focused on the treats of Christmas, the tasty, delicious things that my wife will make or bake, and the things that we share with one another that come only at Christmas. Uh, I'm kind of a whiner when it comes to pumpkin pie and pecan pie because it seems like only during Christmas. Uh, why not pecan pie on May 13th or on uh, July 17th have pumpkin pie? Uh, you, you get my point, I think. It's the things we like uh, that uh, make them special because why? Maybe they only come at random times throughout the year. And so in this passage today from Jeremiah 15, let me read this. Uh, the prophet says, when I read your words, when they came to me, I ate them. They were more joy and my heart's delight, for I bear your name, Lord God Almighty. I looked up that word, ate. When your words came, I ate them. Uh, this is not just uh, slowly uh, tasting something that might be questionable or trying to savor something, and so you... Uh, munch on it slowly. Uh, the word itself in Hebrew means to devour or to consume. Uh, it would be ravenous starvation, uh, desperation. It would carry with it the idea that if I don't get this into me, I'm going to perish. And so let me ask you today, uh, is that how we approach God's word? Do we approach it with a desperation that I need this and without it, I'm going to perish? You know, Jesus said in the New Testament, man cannot live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. You know, that challenge uh, for us in the midst of a busy time or a distracting time is very important. And then if we look at the results, I ate them, and they were my joy and my heart's delight. You know, I don't know what motivates you this Christmas and maybe what you're looking forward to the most. Presents, food, or maybe the presence of family together uh, means the most to you. But what about God's Word? You know, every day we're sharing one verse from the Advent. Uh, maybe you read through the daily bread that we provide, or hopefully you devour the Word of God more so in other ways by reading, studying, praying over, and maybe even memorizing God's Word. And so as you go about a new week, uh, let me encourage you, find a passage, find a plan, devour God's Word this week. Have a great day.